Hey, what's up, guys? Um, I'm going to be doing a update for my Blue Eyes microphone. Um, I base this more off of the uh, deck itself. I know my last one was a Chaos and Blue Eyes uh, deck, but this time it's based more off the structure deck. So yeah, um, I played two Blue Eyes White Dragons. I know some people play three, and then three. Made with eyes of blue, but with the uh, new uh, cat deck that is in the Shadow Specters and uh, uh, that I played uh, at locals. Um, I, I'm glad that I only run two because if I actually had ran three, he played. He basically played creature swap and basically swapped his lower level creatures for mine. So. That's basically why. And then Maiden with Eyes of Blue. Uh, I only played two of these just so uh, I don't I don't overextend stand with that monster. And then two Treasure Seahorse. Um, good card. Uh, I can tribute this if I need to to some blue eyes and it costs as two tributes so. That's also really good. And then, uh, I'll play two White Stone Legend. Uh, whenever this card, or whenever it's this card, then I can search for a Blue Eyes White Dragon and add it to my hand. And then, Mirage Dragon basically allow, uh, allows your opponent not to activate any trap cards during the battle phase, so that's also really good. And then for hand traps, uh, two effect layer came in really handy in, in this deck against the deck that I played at locals, even though there wasn't a natural tournament, but I at least practiced this deck and it, this card came in really handy. And then Shining Angel, um, just for your uh, Rightstone Legend or whatever else I need. And then Honest. I haven't really used Honest, but it comes in handy where I do need to use it. And then Dark Storm Dragon. Um, it's a dark, so I'll explain to you guys why I have this card in here. And it also costs as a normal monster, too, by the effect. And then Define Dragon Apocalypse. Um, just for uh, discarding Whitestone Legend for my deck and. Uh, doing that effect and everything else so but yeah that's basically my monsters now for traps um to play i play two call to haunted uh basically to get back uh blue eyes basically all that's there for <laughs> some tools of bandit to counter traps uh compulse to return a monster basically pretty basic mirror force Pretty standard. Uh, Magic Cylinder. That's basically pretty standard. And then Champion's Vigilance. Also really good. Um, and I actually use this against the uh, uh, new Shell Spectre stack too, so that worked beautifully. And then uh, Eradic Eradicator Epidemic Virus. Now that's what the Dark Storm Dragon is for. Um, I basically dis or uh, discard this card from my field, and uh, basically I your call a spider trap, and yeah, you guys basically know the rest. And then some warning came in so handy in this deck. So, yep, that's basically traps. And then for spells, um, two Dragon Shrine. Don't need to don't need to play any more than two. Just perfect. And then cards of consonants uh, came in handy in this deck. Uh, a wing beat of giant dragon, also a really handy card. Silver cry. Uh, love it. Um, only need to run two. I mean, if you have three blue eyes and then play three, but since I only have two blue eyes and most of them are 
in my graveyard from Drain Shrine, then I only just play two. And then Stampede Destruction, also really good. And then Emmy Controller, um, basically uh, lower attack creatures or uh, higher attack or uh, changing the battle position of the monster to defense. So, really good. And then MST, just for destroying Star Trap. Reload uh, for a better hand. And Dark Hole for destruction. And so, yeah, that's facing my spells. And for my one extra deck, uh, is Azure Eyes Silver Dragon. So, yeah, um, that's facing my uh, update by Stack uh, Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And. I will see you there. All right.